Nick would like to switch from oil to gas, which means the old oil tank has to leave. Now, getting rid of the oil is pretty straightforward, but the sludge, the stuff in the bottom of that tank over decades is another story. Sean Clark is an environmental demolition expert. Sean, thanks for your help today. Now, tell us about sludge. Well, sludge is oil that's turned into water and microorganisms and dirt and has turned into a solid and sits on the bottom of the oil tank. All the stuff that didn't get burned that turns out to be toxic, right? Right. All right, so how do you get rid of it? Well, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to remove this gauge. We're going to pump out all the virgin oil, okay? And then we'll cut a nice big hole in this tank, and then we'll scoop out all the solids. That'll go into a five-gallon bucket, which will go into a DOT 55-gallon drum on the truck. So you put it onto a drum, and then where does that drum go? That drum gets shipped off to a batching plant and, you know, recycled from there. Take care of properly. Yes. All right, cool. So now you're going to cut this tank, the steel tank with the reciprocating saw, with all kinds of sparks. I'm not going to have a fire? Nope. Let me take you outside and show you. Oil doesn't burn as easily as people think. I know. You know, with a residential burn, you got a pump, you got a nozzle, it makes a fine mist, and then you got a spark, and then and only then does it burn. All right. Well, I'm going to take a match and I'm going to throw it in there and show you how hot it Give is. Give it a try. Light it up. Look at that. So that means the sawzall is safe. Yes. Let's get back to our project. Okay. So pump is on. How much oil do we get in the tank? Uh, approximately a uh, quarter of a tank. All right. How long should that take to pump? About 20 minutes. All right, so how much sludge we got? Not too bad. No, not too bad. Looks like 15 gallons or so. Okay. Normal for this age tank. Okay. And so uh, what are we doing now? Just scooping it out? We're scraping it down, and then we're going to start scooping it out and into those five-gallon buckets. Then we'll take those five-gallon buckets and put them into uh, the drum out in the truck. After it's all cleaned out and all wiped out, just carry it right out. Goes our tanks. Where, did, where does this go? This is going to go to a salvage yard, but just not any salvage yard. It's going to go to a tank certified salvage yard Why is to that? make sure that it was cleaned out properly and that we can get the documentation to get back to the fire department. Sure. And it'll all to be, be recycled. Absolutely. Cool. All right, so is that it? Is that the last of nope. our project? The last thing we got to do is remove the film vent pipe. <laughs> That's the biggest thing. Yeah, because I've heard many times that the oil company might have automatic delivery schedule. They come, they see the pipes, they deliver it, it fills the basement. Yep. Good. So. Let's get them out of there. Thanks for all your great work, guys. Thank you. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.